welcome back to another vlog. It has been a minute since I've uploaded. I have been on this routine of uploading, I feel like once every like three, four days, um, definitely not almost a week, which is uh, what this has become. But if you can't already hear it in my voice, I have been sick for like the last four days straight. And it actually felt so good to just put some makeup on today because I haven't worn makeup. I've had a really sore throat. I've been congested. I've had headaches. Um, I didn't go to class on Wednesday. I didn't go to work um, yesterday. I've just been trying to recover. But today is the best that I've felt. Um, I did a lot of sleeping over the last few days. And so I actually feel like today might be an okay day for me. I'm gonna power through. My throat's not super sore, but I'm still congested. I don't have a headache. I didn't get a ton of sleep last night. Um, I just kept waking up because I can't breathe out of my nose. And so it's kind of difficult to sleep. Other than that, I'm good. And I'm so excited to be vlogging again. I got so many sweet messages from you guys just telling me to get well soon and to feel better. And I appreciate that support so much because like I seriously needed it. Today is Wednesday, so it's my long day I have class at 8 30 and then I have like an hour and a half break and lab at 11 30 so during my break I typically go to the bagel shop on campus and I just get a hot coffee and maybe like something to snack on not gonna get a bagel I'll probably get like fruit or, or maybe like a yogurt or something um, and then I just like to work on my pre-lab notebook which you guys saw I did work on this morning but I did not get it complete because it takes me forever so I've been breaking it up a little bit and just trying to do it in the morning and then also in between classes and then as long as I get it done before lab then we're good um, and then later today I may or may not go to the gym kind of depends on how I'm feeling but I would really like to go to the gym because I haven't gone in four days and I miss the gym laptop iPad lab notebook folder pencil bag calculator and lab goggles. I also threw a protein bar in here. I told you guys that I have been really liking these protein bars. At least I mentioned that on Instagram. Um, they're really good. So I'm gonna have this as like a little snack today if I need it. Here is my outfit of the day today. I normally always wear leggings. I'm not trying to dress up for class, but my lab professor is starting to crack down on wearing leggings to lab, and I literally don't own any jeans without rips in them, so this is the least ripped pair of jeans that I could find. So I'm wearing these, my Vans, and just a white t-shirt, and my little gold necklace. And then this is just that cargo jacket that I got from Old Navy, and I'm pretty much just tying this around my waist in case I get cold in class this morning. But but the high today is like 87 degrees, so probably not gonna need it, but maybe in the morning. I had coffee at home this morning because I'm trying to not go to Starbucks today. I don't know why. I just kind of feel like making my coffee here. Trooper comes over every morning whenever I get ice for like my coffee or something, and he waits for his ice cube because Chad and I give him one every time. This is just the medium roast unsweetened iced coffee by Starbucks. You can get this at the grocery store or at like Target. And since this is unsweetened, I like to use a little bit of this French vanilla just to give it a little bit of sweetness, but I literally do the smallest amount of this. And this is the final product. I just got to school and I have like eight minutes before I actually have to start walking up. I always get here early because I don't know if anyone else is like this, but I always have this fear of being late. So I get everywhere that I need to be early. That way I have buffer room. And if I ever get somewhere on time, I feel like I'm late. I don't know why I'm like that. It's honestly annoying sometimes, but I guess it's a good thing.
So it's a little while later, it's actually 1.24, and as you can see, I just got finished with lab, and every single time when I get out of lab, I have these marks all over my face because my lab goggles are so tight, and I've loosened them as much as they go. Apparently, I just have a big head or something because this happens every time. It literally hurts. So I need to get a new pair of lab goggles or something because this is just like what happens and it also like I think it takes my makeup off a little bit too but it goes away after a few hours it's just like this is what I look like anyways I'm about to make lunch and I thought I would show you guys what I'm making I'm just gonna make a little fresh salad with some tuna fish on top for a little bit of protein and I'm really excited because I'm starving always wash your hands as soon as you come in the house from going anywhere because otherwise you're gonna end up sick. And sometimes you end up sick even when you do this, like me right now. So I'm just gonna take a bowl and add some baby spinach to it for my base. Chad just got home and he told me that I couldn't go on the porch to pick up my packages that are here because apparently my Valentine's Day present has been delivered and he doesn't want me to see it, even though I think I already know what it is, but. So I have packages out there too, so I'm like eagerly waiting for him to get home and get that so that I can get my packages. So now I'm just taking some tomatoes and I'm gonna rinse them off. And also, I forgot to tell you guys, but I got a new lab partner. Um, my lab partner, I like ran into her a couple days ago coming out of the library and she told me that she's dropping chemistry and changing her major. So I went into lab today thinking I was not gonna have a lab partner, but then I ended up getting paired up with another girl whose lab partner dropped and she's the sweetest in the whole world. So honestly, ended up working out. Okay, what am I doing? Rinse off cucumber. Oh, I like to cut my cucumbers in fours like so. And Chad is now home. Hey Chad. Hey. He just had an eye appointment and he got his eyes dilated. So he's got those glasses on, the sunglasses. It looks really funny. Now I'm going to open up my tuna. This is just the, um, I don't know, you can read it. Chunk light tuna, I don't know, it's just a can of tuna. When I was little, I never liked tuna, but now I like it and I haven't had it in a long time and then I saw someone else eating it with salad and I was like, I need that. A Little bit of salt and pepper, mostly pepper. And then this green goddess dressing with avocado oil. And this is the final product, super healthy, quick, and easy. So I got a couple of packages in the mail and I thought I would show you guys what I got. This is just some stuff that I've ordered over the last few days. Um, a couple more tops for when I work out because right now I literally wear like the same two or three tops whenever I go to the gym or do yoga. So I got two more from Lululemon because I've been honestly so impressed with the quality. I never thought that I would be that person spending that much money on like one thing, but I can wash these over and over again and they really do keep their quality. So this is the same shirt that I have in black. I just decided to get the one in white. It's actually called almost blue because it's like Here's white underneath, you can see it's like almost blue looking, so get why they call it that. I get it in a size six, and this one is called the Action Always Short Sleeve, and it's cropped. I really, really love this. Um, that's why I got it in the other color as well. The other one that I got is a cropped tank, and this one's like that muscle tank style, and the back is like sheer through the center, and this is the sheer will tank. Um, and I also got this in a size six. I haven't actually got anything from Gymshark ever, but I really, really wanted to try out some things from them because I always hear everyone rave about it. So I got a set from Vital Seamless and I'll show you guys. So this is the Vital Seamless set in green marl, I believe is the color. I really like it. I have not tried it on yet, so I can't really speak too much about it. This video is not sponsored and I will link everything that I'm talking about and mentioning in the description in case you guys want to check it out. Um, 
but yeah this is the vital seamless i got an extra small in the pants because the model was wearing a small and she looked a lot bigger in the legs and the butt than me so i went with extra small and then i got a medium in the top because i always have to size up in the top um so yeah so there's that and the last thing i got is this black fitness jacket it's like that fitnessy material that's like my way of describing it fitnessy material i literally don't know but it's like that stretchy sweat proof material and it's sheer through here and it's got the little thumb holes um see if i can tell you guys what this is called speed speed zip through black i got a size small and i'm really excited about this because i don't have any jackets and whenever i go work out in the morning or go to an early morning yoga class it's always so cold so i just end up wearing my north face which is not like you know meant for working out in so this is perfect i will let you guys know what i think about the gymshark stuff because i haven't tried anything from gymshark before so i'll let you know what i think once i've worn it so i'm about to drink my green juice for the day i have had one of these every single day for the last four days and i honestly feel like it's helping me so much i just feel like it's giving me all the nutrients i need and i know you guys are going to ask me what brand it is um it's the bolt i think it's bolt house farms um all i know is the ingredients are pretty simple bunch of fruits and veggies and a no added sugar and it's still pretty sweet even though the color looks like it wouldn't be um it's easy to drink but i pour it out of the bottle and into a glass just because i really like to drink it through a straw it makes me get it down even faster um so i'm gonna be drinking that and i wanted to show you guys the notes that i'm gonna be reading through right now it's 228 and at 2 30 i have a study sesh with melissa maribel if you guys haven't heard yet we're doing a whole study series over on her channel i'll have it linked below if you guys want to check it out um but these are the notes that i'm using right now because in class we're talking about naming compounds and acids so her notes are really really helpful um there's a whole table of contents and this week specifically we're getting into ion it compounds and I love her notes because it lays everything out in a much simpler way than like what your professor is going to do in class so if you guys are taking chemistry I know a lot of you are and you want to check out these compound notes or any of her notes for that matter I will have these linked specifically because this is what I'm working on this week I don't know if your guys's classes are following the same kind of structure but if you're on compounds these notes will definitely help you um, they're a lifesaver so I'm just gonna be reviewing this for a little while and taking some notes guys I just got my grade back for my short report which was the first short report for my chem lab and I literally got a 100% and I'm so proud of that because the average was an 80 and I didn't feel super confident about it but obviously I did it right studied with Melissa Maribel for literally like two and a half hours straight and I am just exhausted but I still have more to do. Um, I ended up taking out my contacts because they were bothering my eyes which is no surprise. I still don't really know what I'm gonna do about that. I actually have not updated you guys. So like several days ago, I went back to my eye doctors about the whole issue I was having um, and I'm using Daily's Total One contact lenses, which are like the best dailies on the market. They're the most expensive, but they're supposed to be the best. And I'm still having issues with them. So my eye doctor seems to think that I'm just having like a common allergy, which could very well be the case because I feel like I always have a runny nose and stuff as well. So she gave me a prescription eye drop for, it's just like an allergy eye drop to use once a day. And she told me that if that doesn't help, then in like a week, start taking Claritin or something and see how I do with that. Anyways. I am gonna go ahead and end this vlog because I would like to edit and upload it for you guys tonight. I know that a lot of you guys have been waiting for a vlog for like the last week. So thank you for your patience. 
here it is finally. Hope you enjoyed it. If you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video.